Iris Zink here. Thanks for watching my household pet finals for the Cairo Cat Party qualifier for the International Top Cat Challenge. This show had a lot of sponsors. I want to make a point of thanking them. Zymox, which has sponsored all these regional qualifiers as well as the main event. Felis Historica Magazine, sponsoring one of these shows for the first time. The Cat Writers Association, which I am very proud to be a member of. Confetti Art and Design. Uh, just a wonderful collection of sponsors, and we are very grateful to them. And now, on to the kitties. My 15th best household pet is just five months old. Look at that tail. Look how... Look how elegantly he poses, wrapping his tail around him. If he is this good at five months, I can just imagine how impressive he's going to be when he gets older and how much bigger and fluffier that tail's going to get. Today, he's number 15. I was very taken with the markings on this girl. Love that splash of black right in the middle of her forehead set off by those gorgeous green eyes, more splashes of black here and there on that semi-long hair coat, and she is just posing as though she owns the world. Well, today she owns number 14 in my final. This guy had a series of poses, one better than the next. I finaled him because of the photograph and the poses. I'd love to see this guy in real life on a table because if he could show himself in real life the way he shows himself in these photographs, we would have absolutely a winner. Lo I love the way those green eyes are complemented by the green background. Here he is reaching out with one paw as though he's going to either shake your hand or steal your toy. In some of the other poses, he was showing himself off even more to perfection. This guy is a real winner today. He is my 13th best household pet. I love this girl. I have finaled her a number of times. She is 15 and a half years old and look at her. She is absolutely gorgeous. I love the sweet expression in those big blue eyes. I love the torty markings split down the middle of her head. Lovely ears, lovely presentation. She looks so content and so happy. My compliments to her owner for owners for presenting her in such beautiful condition. Today she is my 12th best in household pet class. This guy just really caught my attention. There were a number of other pictures in which he was having a grand old time living it up with various toys and props, but we took the more sedate one for the final picture. He is five months old. Oh, he's just a kitten. No wonder he's having such fun. Beautiful blue mackerel tabby markings, lovely eyes, very intelligent expression, very tolerant of the various things that his owners got him into. He is today my 11th best household pet. My 10th best household pet today is a tortie in white with a very intelligent expression. It looks like she's plotting something very mischievous. I took one look at that picture and I said, I bet the second after it was taken, she did a jump and got away with something. You can just see her thinking about it in this picture. I love that splash of white on her nose, the beautiful markings, the nice white chest. She is just lovely and she is six years old in wonderful condition. Today, 10th best household pet. This guy really charmed me. He's only two years old. He is a silver tabby in white, one of my favorite colors. He's got gorgeous green eyes and he's 
very at home in this outdoor shot. He looks as though he'd be very much at home anywhere you put him. Such a sweet expression. He looks almost like he's smiling at you. Today he's my ninth best. Seen this girl and finaled her a number of times. She has very unusual coloration. She is just seven months old. Her coloration we would almost call a reverse patch tabby. She has both red and brown tabby on her. Usually there's brown tabby with flashes of red. This girl, it's the other way around. She is just a charmer. I love that full tail. I love the way that semi-long coat is beautifully presented. Today, she is my eighth best. This girl is the perfect household pet. Every color you want, all there to choose from. Set off by that lovely white shirt front, patched heavy markings everywhere, gorgeous green eyes, very intelligent expression. She is four years and four months old, and she is in wonderful condition. Today, she is my seventh best household pet. This guy got all dressed up in a tux for this shot and every other shot. Love that streak of white up his nose, the white spats, the white tuxedo shirt front, those glowing gold eyes. Very striking, very impressive. Today, my sixth best. This guy has such a beautifully sweet expression. You want to pick him up and give him a hug. He's a real teddy bear kind of guy. Very cuddly looking, big broad chest, beautiful brown tabby markings, and that sweet, sweet expression. Today he is my fifth best. This girl is 17 years old in this picture and look at her. She is still gorgeous. She is in wonderful condition and she is just beautifully presented. I take my hat off to this cat and her owners for showing her time and time again, always in wonderful condition. Today, she is my fourth best household pet. This girl has very unusual coloration for a household pet. It's not something you see very often. She is a van, perfectly van patterned household pet with color on her head, color on her tail, and not a spot anywhere on her body that I could see. Her expression is very interesting too. Like one of my other cats, she looks like she is plotting mischief. She's looking right at you and asking, do I really have to? Because if I really have to, you just might be sorry. I hope her owner isn't sorry that I have made her third best household pet. Love this guy. Love the photo. Love the pumpkin. Black smoke. Not something you see in the household pet class every day, especially not when it's set off by gorgeous gooseberry green eyes. This guy is a stunner. He is so relaxed. He is so comfortable. I would just love the opportunity to handle him. Today, he is my second best household pet. And my very best household pet is this stunning girl who wins the You Stole My Heart Award. There is something about her expression and her face that makes you just want to pick her up and give her a kiss. Maybe it's those two little markings of white right underneath her nose. They remind me very much of one of my favorite cats, the guy that happens to live in my bedroom. He's my Siberian stud. He's got those same, same little white markings. And when she just looks up at you, you just want to love her to pieces. And today I did. She is my very best household pet. Thank you all.